Eurozone finance ministers have told Greece that the austerity package they brought to Brussels is not enough. The Eurogroup wants further cuts and also wants the Greek Parliament to approve the measures that are proposed. Only then, Athens can receive a second bailout bill of 130 billion euros. We did not yet have all necessary elements on the table to take decisions today. The Greek Parliament should approve on Sunday the policy package agreed between Greece and the Troika. The austerity plan remains very unpopular among the Greek people. Trade unions have called for a two-day general strike to protest. European Commission Vice President Olli Rehn believes that the EU needs to monitor the situation in Athens even more closely. We will need to further strengthen our capacity on the ground in Athens, both for monitoring and for assistance. Greece is faced with a staggering unemployment rate of 21%. The country has been in recession for five consecutive years. It's clear that tensions are running high in Brussels and opinions on Greece's prospects for continued Eurozone membership are becoming more outspoken. European Commission Vice President Nili Cruz earlier this week said that the Eurozone can survive even if Greece is forced out.